Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I have a guest here today. This is my sister Anna. Hi. Um, she did my makeup today. Mm -hmm. And it looks pretty darn good. <laughs> if you guys would like to see Anna doing my makeup, then just keep on watching the video. So, I'm using Maybelline Fit Me Foundation in the shade 120. And we're using the Morphe E8 little foundation brush. And Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Light Sand. And this. Rather than doing like a super thick layer of foundation everywhere, we're gonna just, <laughs> what? Just put a light layer of foundation and then extra coverage. Um, in the only in the places that you need it. What? <laughs> How is it funny? She thinks she needs a makeup artist. <laughs> well, does that not make sense? <laughs> mm-hmm. Hard to get it right under the eye on someone else. Do you find that? And we're using the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder in the shade 10. Fair Light. This is the Morphe M438. <laughs> it's going everywhere. And we'll do the loose powder and like her T zone and like the more oily places. And then we'll just do like a light dusting of pressed powder like around the perimeters of her face. <laughs> it's fun to do yours because like when you're doing other people's, you probably like, oh, I have to be like so gentle. <laughs> And stuff, but, but me, it's okay to just hit me. I can just like beat your face, mm -hmm. and it's fine. Yeah, like imagine doing Kim Kardashian's makeup. <laughs> She's definitely not gonna invite me to do a video with her. <laughs> and then this is her Fit Me Matte and Poreless, like regular powder. And this is the big E41 brush from Morphe using all the new Morphe brushes. And then we're gonna use the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. Okay, so okay. just change the brightness so you can like see us better. Um, and then this is the R2 brush. Now we're doing blush. This is the Becca Chrissy Teigen palette. And we're using this. <laughs> we're using this pink shade right here. <laughs> it just like showed up like double chin. <laughs> And then for highlight, Amy likes to mix Champagne Pop and Prosecco Pop from the Jaclyn Hill face palette. So we'll do that. Okay, and then I'm gonna spray the brush with the Tatcha. It's just gonna amp it up a little bit. If I sound 
funny. <laughs> it's because I'm sick now for the brows. Mm. Hopefully this will work because I'm very particular about your brows. Or peculiar. Peculiar about your brows. I don't think that's the word. <laughs> <laughs> so you've just been using this powder. Mm -hmm. I learned this from editing your video. Sometimes I edit Amy's videos for her. She yes. hasn't in a while though, but I just edited one that's over 20 minutes and she, it will be like home alone all day with nothing to do and she'll be like, I'm gonna film a video. And then I'll be like, cool, I'll come home at night and I'll be like, did you film a video? She'll be like, no, I just didn't have time. So I'm like, okay, what did you have to do? And she'll be like, I had to like make my bed, so it just didn't work out. <laughs> Yeah, I may as well. Okay. It might look better once the other one's done. And you, once you have your mascara on and stuff. Mm. It's like, maybe. Doubt it. Intermission to go do Amy's hair. Three hours later. So we just took a little break to do Amy's hair because her camera was dying. So we charged it and did her hair. <laughs> she doesn't like the eyebrows that I did for her, but that's okay. And now we're gonna do eyes. We're taking this Morphe. It's the 25B Mocha something. We forget the exact name, but it's Mocha something eyeshadow palette or something Mocha. And then we're gonna take a R37 brush and then use this shade right here like as a transition shade for her. All up in the crease. Blend, blend, blend. Okay, next we're taking this brush, the M518, and then we're taking this color right here and putting that just a little bit lower in the crease. And now we're taking this M513. It's a little bit like skinnier and longer. We're gonna use this one now. Just pick up a little because you can always add more. And then I'm just going like super right in the crease with this one and then Kind of like a little bit on the outer corner as well. Actually, you really don't need much because I just thought I was just taking barely anything, but it's showing up pretty good, so. <laughs> what? Now we're taking this like dark plummy purple shade and that's gonna go in her like outer corner. Okay, and then I'm gonna just go back in with one of the first brushes that we use and then like the first transition shades and then just kind of like go and blend out that plum shade that we put in the inner corner. Inner corner. Outer, <laughs> outer corner. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're taking the Jaclyn Hill palette and we are going to mix this shade right here and this one right here for her lid. So I'm just gonna like actually just take my pinky. It's not that sanitary. It's not. <laughs> she <laughs> just my sister, so it doesn't matter. And I'm just putting it. Oh, hmm. What? No, it's all right. It's yeah, it's kind of more brown than it looks like it's gonna be. But I think maybe if we go over it after with that 
lighter, cooler shade, then it will kind of give us the look that we're going for. Honestly, it takes me a really short amount of time to do eyeshadow, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. This is like five minutes. <laughs> okay. Just pat it on a little tighter. This is definitely going to look good with your blue eyes. Mm-hmm. Yup. Now, I'll take that lighter shade. <laughs> This one! <laughs> I like just the way it is. Maybe just in the center. It's gorge! I came up with the best look ideas. Hmm? That's gorgeous, Amy. Mm. Looks beautiful. Are you doing the underneath? The like underneath the eye? Mm hmm. I think, yeah, we're just gonna stick with that kind of like in the middle. Okay, look towards the cam. Okay, so we're going back in with those first couple transition shades with this M506 brush. So, eh, like this one, and then like this color. I'm just gonna mix them together just because I'm lazy. And we'll go underneath. Now we're going with this like brownish purpley one underneath of the eye and a little bit like closer to her lash line. Okay, and then we're just gonna put really tight in there that last darker purple shade. Super But not quite in my eye. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't in your eye. Just kind of sticking to the outer corner. Oh, let me see. Okay, yep, looks good to me. Okay. Now for mascara, the one she always uses. The Essence Volume Stylist Mascara. Now, um, for her lips, I'm going to use the Buxom Plump Line Lip Liner in the shade Hush Hush. And then over top of that, um, we're going to use the Maybelline Super Stay Matte Ink in the shade 15 Lever. How cute does she look? <laughs> she said she's gonna go fix her eyebrows after this, but <laughs> oh, well, I, they're fine. It's just not how I normally do them, so I'm not used to it. Nice. <laughs> Good job. Thanks. Thank you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, let us know down below if you want to see me doing Anna's makeup. I think it would be pretty fun, but she doesn't really want to come on here with no makeup at all. So, all right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really hope you enjoyed the video. And I guess maybe, maybe we'll both see you in my next video. Bye. Bye.